Hi everyone, I'm Miss Katie from Rockland Public Library and welcome to Rockin' Story Time. We're gonna start off by clapping our hands. Can you clap your hands along with me at home? Here we go. We clap and sing hello. We clap and sing hello to all our friends at story time. We clap and sing hello. Good job, everyone. Now we're going to stomp our feet. Can you lift your knees up really high? We're going to lift them up and we're going to stomp together. Here we go. We stomp and sing hello. We stomp and sing hello to all our friends at story time. We stomp and sing hello. Good job, everyone. Welcome, welcome. Hello and welcome to another story time. Today, we are going to be reading about elephants. Those are big, amazing animals. So we're going to say elephants for our word today. So for our bread and butter rhyme, we clap our hands and then we're gonna clap our knees. So we keep a rhythm together with a clap on our hands and a clap on our knees. Can you do that with me at home? Here we go. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say elephants as quickly as we can. Elephants, 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 elephants. Can you do it at home? Elephants, 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 elephants. Oh, not too bad. All right, let's do another one. Are you ready? Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say elephants as slowly as we can. Elephant. Oh, good. There's a lot of really good noises in there. Let's try it one more time. Are you ready? Elephants. Oh, pretty good. Nice job, everyone. All right, let's try another. Here we go. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say elephants as loud as we can. Elephants. Good job. All right, one more. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say elephants as quiet as we can. Elephants. Good job. Let's see what our first elephant story is today. It is called Strictly No Elephants. Strictly No Elephants. That means there are no elephants allowed in this building. So Strictly No Elephants is written by Lisa Makcha and illustrated by Tatian Yun. Let's see what happens in Strictly No Elephants. The trouble with having a tiny elephant for a pet is that you never quite fit in. Here he is in his room with his elephant for a pet. Can you imagine having an elephant for a pet? No one else has an elephant. If you can see in the picture, this girl has a bird, there's a cat, there's a fish, there's a dog, there's even a little boy with a dog down here. Do you have any of those animals at home? But I bet you don't have an elephant. Every day, I take my elephant for a walk. He is very thoughtful sort of walk. He doesn't like the cracks on the sidewalk much. I always go back and help him over. That's what friends do, lift each other up over the cracks. Today, I'm walking my tiny elephant to number 17. It's the pet club day and everyone will be there. Oh, here he is, leaving his house and joining the others. They're all going to pet day. Do you see? We have a dog. And what's this one? Another dog and a cat. Come along. There's a good boy, I said. I coax him the last few steps. It'll be fun. Don't worry. When I look up, there's a sign on the door. Hmm, it says, strictly no elephants. Hmm, so dogs are allowed and cats are allowed, but no elephants. My tiny elephant 
leads me back to the sidewalk, never minding to check the cracks. That's what friends do, brave the scary things together. There they are. Oh, look, he's sad, and it's turned the world kind of gray and sad. But there's someone else here with him. Here he is with the elephant. Whose is this? Did you try to go to the pet club meeting too? The girl asked. Yes, I say, but they don't allow elephants. The sign didn't mention skunks, said the girl, but they don't want us to play either. They don't know any better, I say. He doesn't stink, the girl adds. No, he doesn't, I agree. What if we start our own club? Come along, I say, making certain that my tiny elephant follows me, because that's what friends do. Never leave anyone behind. Here they go. And look, I'm starting to see other animals in the windows. Do you see any animals? Here we go. There's a penguin. And what about this? A giraffe. Someone has a giraffe for a pet. Whoa, look at all those animals. What animals do you see? Do you spy a bat or a porcupine? Oh, there's even a narwhal. We can play here, one of our friends says. All of us. Right there. So we paint our own sign. First, we write strictly no strangers, and then strictly no spoil sports. But then we cross it out and we say, all are welcome. Oh, look. Here they are playing together. And there are strange animals, like the giraffe and the penguin. But look who else is coming along. We have some regular animals coming too. Everyone gets to play together. My tiny elephant will give you directions if you need them. Because that's what friends are for. There they are, all playing together. The end. Great listening, everyone. Let's see. I have a little elephant rhyme for us, and this one has a little bit of counting in it. So we are going to count up to five. Can you get out your five fingers? Let's count up to five together. Can you count with me? One, two, three, four, five. That's right. All right, so in this rhyme, this is about an elephant in the bathtub. Can you imagine? How big would a bathtub have to be to fit an elephant inside? Really, really big, right? Well, this is about an elephant taking a bath and inviting more elephants to join them. So we're going to do something together. We're gonna to go knock, knock. We're gonna to pretend to knock on a door. We're gonna knock with our hands together. You're gonna to go like this, knock, knock. Can you knock on the door? Knock, knock. Good job, knock, knock. And then we're gonna splash in the water, splash, splash. So you can do that either splashing here up high or you can splash by hitting your leg, splash, splash. Splash, splash. All right, so we're gonna go knock, knock, splash, splash, come on in. Let's do that one more time, are you ready? Knock, knock, splash, splash, come on in. Good job, all right, we're ready. So here is our elephant in the bathtub. And look how big this bathtub is compared to the elephant. This must be huge. It would definitely not fit into any rooms in my house. So here we go. One elephant, one elephant in the bathtub, going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash, come on in. So we're gonna take our one elephant and we're gonna add another one. Now how many elephants do we have? One, two, here we go. Two elephants in the bathtub, 
going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash, come on in. Can you guess how many we have now? We have our two elephants and we're gonna add one, two, three. We're gonna add a third. Here we go. Three elephants in the bathtub going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash, come on in. Now how many elephants are we gonna have? Do you know? Can you guess? Let's see. We have one, two, three, four. Four elephants. Four elephants in the bathtub going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash, come on in. Are you ready? How many do we have now? We have our last elephant. Ready? Let's count together. One, two, three, four, five. Five elephants. Five elephants in the bathtub going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash. They all fall in. Good job, everyone. That was great. Let's see what our last story is today. It is a parade of elephants. A parade of elephants. I think maybe we could make ourselves into a parade of elephants. What do you think? A parade of elephants by Kevin Hanks. There we go. Look! Elephants! Look, elephants! There's one, one, two, one, two, three. Can you count these ones with me? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Five elephants. Five elephants marching. Can you march with me? We're going to march. March, 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 march. Five elephants marching. A parade of elephants. March, 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 march. Big and round and round they are. Big and round and round they go. Up and down, up and down. Can you go up and down with me? Up and down, up and down. Oh, over and under. Can you do that with me too? Over and under and over and under. Can you see them going? It looks like they're going over bridges. Here we go, over and under. Ooh, in and out, and in and out, and in and out. They march and they march and they march. They march all day. Da dum ba 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 dum. And when the day is done, they are done. What do you think they do at the end of the day? Oh, I bet they get sleepy at the end of the day. Oh, they yawn. Oh, and they stretch. Can you give a stretch at home? Oh, they stretch. And then they stretch. And they yawn. Oh. But before they sleep, they lift up their trunks. They lift them up and they trumpet, scattering stars across the sky. Good night, elephants. The end. Great listening, everyone. That was great. Let's end with head, shoulders, knees, and toes. Are you ready? Can you stand up with me and do head, shoulders, knees, and toes? Here we go. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Eyes and ears and mouth and nose, boop, boop. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Good job, everyone. Do you think we can do it a little faster? Here we go. 
Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Eyes, and ears, and mouth, and nose, boop, boop. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Good job, everyone. Thank you for coming this week, and I can't wait to see you all next week. You ready? Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Eyes, and ears, and mouth, and nose, boop, boop. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Bye-bye.